Hi there, folks. Katie Anna Harris with Usborne Books and More. And raise your hand if you are a fantasy fiction lover like me. Well, guess what, folks? We have a ton of fiction books, storybooks, all the way up through young adult that are just right for the little one in your life. And I want to start off telling you about one of my current new favorites, Two Pirates and One Robot. Well, what do Two Pirates and One Robot equal? fun and adventure because these awesome pirates that's Captain Jetsam and Flotsam her crewmate are going to be going on an epic adventure where they are going to try to steal sorry plunder some space booty now what happens is that they start getting chased and they find out that they are running out of gas in order to get back home and they're going to need to drop weight. Well, unfortunately, their friend who happens to be a robot is the only thing that weighs the exact same amount of weight that they need to get rid of. And unfortunately, or I guess fortunately for the robot, they may decide that friendship is better than any loot that they might possibly need. Super cute book. Who doesn't love some pirates and robots? Really fun artwork and a tiny bit of science thrown in there too. Now the next book is such a sweet group of books. This is from a series that there's Oceanly, Animally, Americanly, and Once Upon a Timely. And this is so sweet. It is a little rhyming book. That's all about how much I love you. I love you fluidly like water meets land. I love you openly like the sky. I love you freshly like salty spray. I love you smoothly like a ray. Have you ever touched a ray? Because they are super smooth. It is like touching wet velvet. And that sounds gross and creepy, but really delightful if you ever get to go on one of those touchy-feely aquarium things. These are so beautiful, so touching and sweet, and I love the artwork that's in all of these books. And there's a little bit on a bunch of different subjects. They also teach incredible large vocabulary words that you're not going to normally come up against. So, I love you markedly, like a lobster float. That is markedly not a normal word that you're going to be coming across in most books. I love that it really stretches the imagination while stretching vocabulary and learning at the same time. Now next, an Usborne Books and More trip would not be the same without a little talk about our favorite man, Mr. Nibbles here. And yes, you can get him to snuggle with at night as well. Nibbles likes to nibble books. And we have now a new book in the series, Nibbles right here and the monster hunt and he actually finds an equally mischievous little friend and they of course nibble their way through a ton of different books together and you actually get to follow the path on the book inside the book where nibbles is chewing through and you'll see that there are many different places where he gets into different stories gets into lots of trouble as nibbles always does and possibly might even make a break for it at the end. Love Nibbles. I cannot get enough of him and I can't wait for the newest one to come out. Well, which that one just came out, so it'll probably be a minute, but super exciting. Now, when you're talking about learning to read, we have so many sets that are going to be incredible for your budding reader. One of my favorites is the Usborne Very First Reading Set. Now, this is a set of 15 books that actually walks you through ways to teach your child how to read. And it's going to use different phonemes in each book. So each book, starting with book number one, will be the first book you want to read together. And it's going to have parts in it that are talking to the parent. It's then going to have large print at the bottom so that you can have your little one read that or read it together when you're first starting off. It has smaller print at the top that you can read. So it's going to feel like they're really succeeding at reading. I love these dual readers. 
Um, and they also have super fun stories, of course. Gotta love my pirates. And each book is going to focus on just a few specific words. And there's also, at the end of the book, there's going to be um, a really fun kind of quiz style game that helps you really talk about what you just read about. So you're getting to see, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> you're getting to see if they really are learning, they're paying attention, following along, using those reading comprehension skills that are going to be super important. And like I said, there is a guide for parents at the back to help you know exactly which sounds that you are focusing on in that book. This is 15 books, and also there is included a reading guide for the parents to help you really learn how to most uh, clearly utilize this set of books. And there are a couple other sets that are very similar to these. Now, for the last thing I want to show you is one of my daughter, my four-and-a-half-year-old daughter, has found out that her daddy loves comic books. And I am a sucker for some comics and some graphic novels, especially myself. I love that it gets readers who may not normally be excited about reading, really excited about picking up a book. And these books, our whole graphic novel series is amazing. We have Jason and the Argonauts. We have Thor. We also have Hound of the Baskervilles. We have Dracula. We even have Alice in Wonderland, which is my daughter's current favorite, with such amazing artwork. The artwork in these books is phenomenal. I cannot get enough of it. It is so beautiful. And from the Shakespeare himself, one of our newest is Hamlet. Once again, with these beautiful, beautiful artwork really gets to tell this, these classic stories in a way that kids who are reluctant readers can really get excited about it. Younger readers really feel like they're following along with the whole plot line and storyline. And the speech bubbles, you can actually use those as a, a learning to read guide because they're just tiny little bits, tiny nuggets of words that you don't have to stress about reading an entire paragraph. These books are absolutely amazing. You have to check them out. So until I talk to you again, happy reading.